Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosive one, Jonas. We are the man on the sticks. I have a stick. You have a stick. We're looking at my stick, mm. and we're playing Borderlands. Big oh, update hit, Jonas. Oh man, I got I got a shield for you too. By the way, I'm coming. Right. But anyway, it's an update. Big huh? update happened. So. First off, one of the most important things, the vault boom, 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 has boom. been upgraded to well over a hundred. But Jonas, oh, it do you goes, need to buy it, more? It goes up to three hundred squares now. So you have to keep buying those upgrades, though. So the amount of SDUs that we have, yes, you can go beyond that. Uh, it gives you it gives you a reason to hold on to money now. Um, other updates. Oh, yeah, I dropped that shield for you up here. That's fine. Other updates. Every character except for Amara has been buffed in some way. Oh, because they're like Amara's where it's Oh, you're over here. Yeah, so every character's been buffed. Um, there are now, uh, dedicated loot drops. I, I don't know where you put that shield, but it's, it's fine. It's in with your, it's in the area where the, uh, yeah. Oh, in my room? Yeah, right where you were standing at. All right, cool. Uh, so every character's been buffed designated loot drops, which means that if you want a certain gun, a certain enemy drops it. But now we you gotta kinda we gotta get out there and farm enemies to figure out where it goes. Uh there Oh, is, so they're not as random anymore. Yeah, there's still world drops, <laughs> but every like well, certain bosses and everything drop certain guns. Okay. Well that makes it a little easier to find a gun you want. Yeah. Yes, exactly. So, like, if you're looking for, if I'm looking for another Where easy mode, I can now get it from a certain boss and not just, like, endlessly farm just praying that I get one. Oh, okay. Well, that's cool, because I yeah. want an easy mode, too, so we should go do that. <laughs> I don't know which boss drops oh, it yet. Okay. It just happened a uh, day or two ago. This thing right here, Jonas, can't access it now, but that is the Malawan takedown, which just happened. Um, okay. We're gonna just uh, Where's go. Where's that at? We're gonna, we, oh we're, wait, we're, we're gonna. Gonna. What room is that in? <laughs> I was. I thought I was with you, but I'm not. Oh, uh, you're not. You're not missing anything. Yeah, it's that little little ah, triangle on the wall. Oh, okay. All right, we're gonna head to Necro de Feo, where we're supposed to be Stop anyway. Yeah, see. Stop but uh, Malawan Takedown Jonas yes. is not a continuation of the story in any way. Okay. It is a PVP. Let me Kind of event where it's basically like a raid. Oh, okay. Uh, I tried playing it by myself with my level 50 Amara. After about 30 minutes of just playing like a straight up little B, I died <laughs> and had to start over. And I was like, F this. It is hard. It is this hard. All right. Is it hard because the enemies are ridiculous or like what you're supposed to do is ridiculous or what? I mean, yeah, I was trying it on Mayhem 2 by myself, but I can <laughs> usually, I can usually like, I can beat the everything else in the game, Mayhem 2, no problem. But yes, it, it's it's difficult. It, it is designed definitely for at least uh, three to four people to play through it. Oh, that's together. cool. I can dig it. It is pretty cool. Um. Unfortunately, it is still difficult to find people who pl to play with who don't just quit out. Um, right. It's like you need a group. Like yeah. like when we used to play Destiny, you need like a good raid group that everybody like can be on board. And yeah. And I don't know if it's necessarily uh, good enough or enough to uh, bring people back to the game who left. Because a lot of people played the game and they beat it super fast. And then, uh, you know, like they kind of stopped playing the Did game. Did the level cap go up? I don't think so. Oh, then so. that ain't going to bring people back, dude. That's what you need to do to bring people back to the game. Because once you hit level 50, a lot of people are like, well, yeah, I'm not progressing yeah. anymore. You're not wrong, man. All like, right. Yeah, I don't know why it would be such a big deal to... But, uh... Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So not a whole lot of, like, uh, weapon fixes on this, on this patch, but a lot of quality of life things. Like, uh, your character... Your character, they made the Iron Bear more uh, 
viable, worthwhile. <laughs> yeah, more Not viable. Tread pets have been made more viable. So what about uh, Zane's clone, etc.? Absolutely, more viable now. What do they do? All of give them more. Uh, dude, I don't know the exact. <laughs> there was the p the patch notes for this thing is like six pages. Holy crap! It's dude. ridiculous. Well, now me. I can stop talking trash about. It. They haven't fixed anything. And they did try to fix most of the bugs. Like go into your menu right now. Do it. I want oh. you to do it. Oh my god! It doesn't. Take yeah. You see how fast you get into your menu now? It only takes eight Look seconds at that. instead of 190 oh, seconds. Oh, I'll take it. Dude, me All too. Right. It was like, right, I'm like, fine. okay, well, we're dead because I'm just trying to switch weapons. All of your face. It's the <laughs> blood, probably. Oh, Jonas, look. He's I out can, of the wall. I, he is out of the wall. I wish I, so you can pay this guy. To, don't shoot. Where are you shooting it? Off the edge. <laughs> and he'll shoot guns. And I could legit like sit here and pay him one iridium. It happened so slow. And he can he can throw exotics out. Really? He can. How many iridium is it worth? The four. From the website, not even the website, the YouTube channel, I should just be honest. The YouTube channel, the YouTube video I watched said about every 30 iridium, he'll spit out an exotic, which is not a bad cost effectiveness. Now, I'm not going to sit here and do it. I was just kind of hoping he would show it. I, I thought we were going to be able to jump across here, but I don't know. No, we got to go finish something, dude. Well, why does it say to go here? It does not say to go here. All right, where does it say to go then? Spit me out a gun, fam. We are totally in the wrong place. Yeah, dude, we gotta go away. Where are we going? You're back. Oh, we gotta go over here, dog. Yeah, dude, I know. All right, well, let's let's get out of here. One more play. <laughs> I was following you, dude. You're well, like the, you're the corn of the group. Don't ever follow me. <laughs> follow me. That's Papa Roach, by the way. No, it was follow the leader. Oh. <laughs> and I think I was thinking of Uncle Cracker. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and everything is all right. Wow, dude. Can you uh, imagine, like, uh, what? being Uncle Cracker? Could I? Yeah. You mean being a multi billionaire? He is your... not a billionaire by any means. I think my... that is. No. He has a hit single, Jonas. Dude, we're going to have a hit single. <laughs> yeah, if you ever get your lyrics done. You don't have. You didn't give me a. <laughs> I need music, bro. I gave you a beat. We agreed on a beat. You told me you that you were creating a beat. We agreed on a beat. Creating a beat. <laughs> you told me you had a. And uh, I still take my time to lace the beat, and I still keep it up for the streets. It's D R E. Yeah, dude. And that's what you got to do. I'm representing all the gangsters all across the world. Yeah, man. We got to be louder. I think we're being low volumes. Uh, who, us? Yeah, we're not going to get picked up on the microphone. What are you talking about? My uh, my, my chest is not normal today. <laughs> I mean, you might have an issue, sir, if you, if you feel like you got an issue, but... Yeah, dude. I tend to generally talk in lower tones yeah, and volume. Why do you? Yeah. And it, it picks me up all right. I just keep my mouth right up on this some beat. Yeah, dude. Is this where we're supposed to go first? I don't know. I'm glad so we're look, recording boom, we're looking like fools. No, it's fine, dude. It's fine. This is what they expect. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. I mean, so, we're trash. Yeah. Well, but we've been over here. I mean, I'm fine to go back. Let's just effing do it. Let's we were, get it. Nah, dude, we didn't finish what we were doing. I mean, I mean, it's clearly this area is all blued out, so we've been over here. I just don't know what we... Yeah, we got to the end, and then you were like... Did we? Go. Is that what happened? Yeah, like we didn't go in. Oh. <laughs> I mean, we can run. run. All right. Yeah, let's, let's just run it. Let's see if we can make it. Then. Let's go. All right. But we gotta like run together, cause if not, one of us is gonna get through. <laughs> yeah, namely yourself. All right. Try to. Uh, I mean, my slide isn't that fast. On no, this I'm right. I'm good. Enemies can't really like kill you in this With game. With one shot. Yeah. Yeah, you ain't gonna get one shot. Is yeah, I think we got all the way to the end, and we were gonna we had to transport to a new area. Oh yeah, okay. So we're just gonna speed past all of this. Yeah, yeah. We'll just get get on through. Wake me up before you go, go. Wake me up before you. Oh, oh yeah. you know where we just beat the boss? Yeah, we were right here, we're about to go into a new area. Huh? Was it? No, because we had beat General Tron in the last one. Isn't that what happened? I don't remember. Yeah, cause we gotta go through here. Is this where he is? Oh, 100% is where he is. We have to fight him again. 
Well, we do not get the choice, sir. So, no. No. Oh, yeah, we did beat the boss, huh? We're All good. Right. Yeah. So, yeah, there you go. First 10 minutes of the video is just some recap. No, nah, dude, you <laughs> talked about you talked about being game good. I talked about being cheesy. Oh, dude, it ain't easy being cheesy. It ain't, Jonas. Oh, I like it. T T Tazendir Ruins. Tazendir Ruins. That's like, Sounds the like my bedroom. Tasmanian Devil and Bambi. Aww. Have, have a baby. Oh, Bambi. And it's a Tazendir. A ta <laughs> <laughs> what? Why do I find that so funny? <laughs> I don't know. It's pretty not, bad. <laughs> yeah, it's real bad. It made me laugh. It's not I really good. Enjoyed it's, it. It's not good at all. But short notice, you know. Yeah, dude, it's cool. Like I, I like good jokes, and that was one. <laughs> all right. you made it. Hey, we made it. Oh, we made it. That's your ticket to the vault. Oh, I know where we are. It's yeah. the Tazendir Ruins. Yeah. I've been here a hundred times, dude. I haven't. No, dude. Oh, hey guys. Hey guys. So yeah, man, they they actually are putting up some effort to improve this game. I kind of feel like it's a little too little too late, and I don't mean like the game isn't good still. I mean it's a great game. Definitely had a lot of fun with it. Yeah. Um. They got another DLC coming out that is Moxie and uh, Handsome Jack base. Apparently, like this one, I think is more storyline. But I'm not. Oh, I'm not Handsome sure. Jack's coming back, dude. Uh, no, Handsome Jack had like a, a casino, and you end up Moxie ends up taking it over and doing something with it, and you know, there, there, hilarity ensues. Oh, dude, I love hilarity. It's my favorite. In the form of bad puns. Oh, dude, I've never been a pun. I've never met a pun I didn't like. Big pun. Oh, dude. Are you something. familiar with Big Pun, John? I didn't like Big Pun, so I take that. Pun. Oh. No, I don't know. <laughs> Just, I've heard of him. I don't know. Jeez. I don't know his work though. Yeah, he's, I'm not fond of his catalog. I guess. He's he's passed away. Have some respect for the dead. Oh, pun did? Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> He's been dead for like 25 years. Oh man, poor guy. <laughs> Alright, yeah, that's fair enough. Said it was just a story. <laughs> so did everyone. This place is Except weird. Yeah, dude, it looks she like my bedroom. After we got married on Pandora, we left to find Necker to fail uh, for our honeymoon. Well, we ended up crash landing. See, I put the ship on autopilot while we got busy. That's on me. Oh my and god. so was she. So, Anywho, the ship was kaput, he's talking was kaput, about having sex with his wife. We Dude, why is he talking about coitus? I don't know if he talks. Oh man, it's still, still ghosts. Oh really? Yeah. Dude, it's almost Thanksgiving. I know. I, I saw the ghost pop out and I was like, oh, it's. It can't be. <laughs> it's TNT Dynamite's grenade. It can't be, but it is the Jonas. They're still okay. ghosts. Okay, doesn't the community like say that enough is enough? Oh yeah, dude, they're tired of the ghosts. And they've actually, uh, they've lessened the amount of ghosts. And they increase like, uh, for the Halloween event, they increase the drops that each ghost gives you, and there's less of them. God. Because everybody was like, yeah, this is a lot of ghosts, and this is too much. Well, you're already trying to do something that's not easy, and then you have extra enemies popping out of the enemies. <laughs> <laughs> like, dude, come on. I mean, I'm, I'm on board. I actually, uh, I finished all of the Halloween stuff with my other character. So, uh, I was, yeah. Did you win, man? <laughs> no. I won a weapon skin that doesn't even feel as good as the time I would have saved by not knowing it. Oh, well, at least you have that for your life. Yeah, so, yeah. Oh, I have dude, a, I'm really glad that, you, that that happened. <laughs> I have a feeling <laughs> of uh, self-fulfillment. Yeah, mm. completion. Yeah, I did it. You, you played yourself to completion. Yeah, I beat I beat the General Han 25 times. Wow. Which that seems worth it. Which your freaking grenade just taking over the whole goddamn North American oh, territory. Oh, I love this grenade, dude. It makes me want to kill. I'm going to call that grenade Louisiana Purchase. Oh, dude, I would love to see Louisiana Purchase again. 
Louisiana Purchase was the name of a drag queen that me and Jonas went to see. And funny well, enough, we didn't were, go to see her. She was there. I mean, she, we went to go see the drag show, and she was like the, the she was like the star attraction, right? Yeah, she was the VJ. Yeah, dude. And drag shows, absolutely amazing. Do not. I understand a lot of you got your preconceived notions and your ideas and yeah. your and your reservations. Drag shows absolutely amazing. Oh my god, yeah. One of the one of the best things I've I've ever in, involved myself in. But they were doing the songs of Queen. Yeah, and you're a big Queen guy, so. And it, it's funny because at that moment, like at the moment of watching the drag show and them doing Queen, I realized that wait a minute, Freddie Mercury was a homosexual man yeah and he was he was pretty open ish about it not uh, yeah well i think at points he was yeah. yeah 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 as much as you could be in like the 70s and 80s yeah and uh he was in a band named queen yeah i was like it was so on the nose i i totally it was, missed it yeah it was so blatant that everyone was like oh. yeah I, I don't think a lot of people even realize the the connection oh i there. agree it's like when you watch fight club and the first time and then after you know what happens you go back and watch it again you're like how did i not know this is what was going on the entire movie it's like Dang. one giant clue yeah i love that effing movie too man when you start talking fight club you get me off the glimpse i know it's like I just say the word and you're like oh hello hello Drop me a exotic. Come here, skull face. Yeah, I wish the skull. Ooh, they dropped me a purple. Ooh, ooh, what's behind this bramble patch here? A uh, bramble? Oh, look at this. A little oasis. Oh, Good I bet there's something piece. in here to make us. Oh, there's a chest. Green boys. And greens. Oh, I got a blue boy in there. Oh, man, did you? Old man, did you? Yeah. Old man, old man did you here? Take that, thank you. I got thank a perp you. in here somewhere. What did I get? All it right. must be a quick charge coffee maker shield. Haha, <laughs> get it? You get coffee. You get it. Coffee cake. I think I should have zigged when I should have zagged here. <laughs> oh no, we're going the right way. Then later, she, well, Don't talk she about died. it. Dude, we're I doing had to raise it. The kids alone. I thought opening a vault would oh, be his wife died. <laughs> From having a quarter with her? No. Wait, got kids, Typhon? He's got yeah, kids. Cool. The boy, he got sick all Aww, the time. Poor guy. And my daughter talked circles around me. The only time they'd sit still was to hear about my adventures. Killing monsters, opening vaults, being a hero. They couldn't get enough. Mm -hmm. I filled their heads with all sorts of stories. Even told them about the great vault. <laughs> that was a mistake. That's death. A story can be a dangerous thing in the wrong hands. Yeah? Yeah, that's that's important information. Once you remember that he has I hear kids. you feet important that you know he was a single dad and it's hard out there for him you know, you've never been a single dad you know you don't know how what it's like i have not you don't know what it, how don't it feels know it's like dude you're absolutely correct i have no clue what it's like to be me yeah dude uh rip petty dude is he there too yeah dude he accidentally overdosed is that really what happened yeah jesus man yeah it sucked dude it was like yeah. yeah, I guess once you get all the money to get all well, the no, drugs. Well, no, he accidentally overdosed, not like, he like had, um, he had like, it was like, he accidentally overdosed on like prescription pills. Like, you like, mean Michael Jackson? Yeah, but that guy had somebody feed him to him. I mean, do you think Tom Petty doesn't? <laughs> no, from what they said about him, he was, uh taking him under control because his hip was basically completely shot and he needed surgery, yeah, well, but he wasn't having surgery and then he ended up doing something. Yeah, well, yeah, it sounds pretty similar, just saying. Sounds to me like he was like, hey doc, I need some pain pills, and whereas they would have told me or you, well, go home and take Tylenol. Go have surgery. Yeah, go have surgery or go home and take some Tylenol and ibuprofen, and his doctor was like, well, you give me $10,000, I'll give you a pocket full of perks. Oh, wow. Look, I don't even know. That's too much window for me. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know about a pocket full of perks? A pocket full of posies. A, a perky pill? A perky pill. Yeah, man. Just saying that when you're rich, you know you got access you to some drugs. Yeah. Yeah, dude. I mean... I mean, it's a nice... It's a pretty nice I mean, setup. I mean, if you think about it, I mean, magic jar from HIV. <laughs> 
it no just it just disappeared. And no one else has really had. So I don't yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, everybody else is HIV. Just the is one still person here. in the world that happens to be a famous million millionaire basketball player. Yeah, man. So how's your HIV? Uh, I never had it, so I don't know. Oh, sweet! You must have a Magic Johnson severance package. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations. Magic Johnson severance. Severance back. Oh god, don't touch me. <laughs> I've gotten so out of using my neck because it was crashed. Uh, it still ain't the best. No, it's, I mean, it seems more powerful now, I guess. I don't know. Really? I have no idea. Apparently, it's supposed to uh, be able to take less damage late game, do more damage Ooh, late game, because they just weren't doing any of Well, yeah, things. yeah, from what you said, that ev everybody's, like, ultimate was just, like, so by the time you got to end game, you're just like, okay, let's just shoot the gun. Yeah. Which part of the thing about this game is using the skill tree and all that stuff. So. I mean, yeah, the, the uh... Like the, uh, what do you call those? The passive abilities are really what drives a character. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They give you yeah, all those sort of bonuses and right, stuff. That's like death. I think we go this way? Yeah, this is the right way. There you are. I'm in a mech. I have a mech. Yeah, I'm a go. guy in a mech, but I'm a girl. He's <laughs> <laughs> moving slow. Oh. Oh, those they boys know I already kill us. opened the sucker years ago. Oh god. There's a there's a dog with lasers on its back. It's oh. a laser dog. Laser dog. Laser dog. Laser dog. Laser dog. Laser dog. Oh dude. I got the shield on this thing. I can stand by it now. <laughs> I got the shield on this yeah, thing. Yeah, dude, my mech has a shield and I can stand in its like a uh, Winston bubble, dude. Oh yeah, I do. I like the bubble. Yeah, like I, I don't know what it does exactly. It the... shields the guy, but I think it shields me too it if I'm inside it. Shields the guy. It shields the mech oh, from taking shield. as much damage. It's a. Uh, it's, oh my god, what is trying to murder me? It's a freaking flying bug of some sort up here that is now no longer in the land of the living. I'm trying to take out this uh, turret that's shooting rockets at freaking death. Ah, here's this man. Right here. yeah, I'm shooting oh god, hit me right in the freaking face with a rocket while I was trying to kill him. Why would he do that? You mean this turret over here? Yeah, well, I'm gonna how, you, how you living on that? How you living? What? How you living? What? In living color. Yo, man. They need to. They need to bring back in living color. Dude, the, they can't, man. What are you talking about? There, like, if they, there was a lot of controversial things in there. I mean, yeah. They can't. It's like bringing back The Office, dude. Michael Scott was a just a bad human being. And well, like, the Office isn't even that old, which is what kills me. Yeah, dude. Well, I mean, you, you, I think you're not thinking how old it is, dude. Some of that stuff was like 2002. Yeah, but that's, that's like 20 years, dude. All right, listen. <laughs> That's not like 20 it's years. Like 15, it's more like 15. A hard 15. It is a hard 15, but we ain't gonna, we ain't gonna flex Dude, it up to 20. Dude, we didn't have smartphones when The Office first came out. Hey, we, look, okay, look. come on. That's how different the world is. I want, I want you to... You know what? Who needs a phone, Jonas? You I didn't? hate having one. No, you do too. God. My problem with phones is that it just gives people access to you, and then and they're like, "It's mad when you're like, right. you're like, I texted you, and you're like, yeah, I have yeah. a freaking life, dude. Yeah. I don't, my my life isn't reply to you. Yeah, I used to could just ignore your call, and now I gotta like be all rude <laughs> or considered rude because I didn't want to answer the call. Yeah, dude, you're just like, I got stuff to do. I'll reply later when I have time to talk. Right? But they're like, I uh, a friend of mine is a girl. Was like, I met, I met this uh, dude, and, and I met him at the gym. And he was, she's like, Ooh, he's a pretty hot guy, like super fit, whatever. And he would like text me, and then like, like a few minutes later, when I didn't reply, he'd be like, oh, okay then. And I was like, she was like, I'm like, dude, I have oh, a yeah. pretty light. Yeah, that's weird, dude. And uh, that's that. That's that. Um. Millennial, uh, millennial, millennial entitlement, right there. Yeah. Well, she also said he had like zero personality, but he was like super hot, and I was like, well, that's probably his thing. Like, he doesn't have to have a personality. He's yeah. super hot. He's expect. He's used to like he, other people who have no personality just wanting to message him back immediately because he's hot. 
And she's like, oh yeah, I didn't think about it. <laughs> like, that's probably you can't exactly believe that you wouldn't message him. You know how hot he is? Yeah, he's like, how dare you wait three minutes to get back to me? I'm hot. Excuse me, I'm hot over here. <laughs> I need you to go ahead and message me back. Yeah, I want to talk to you, man. so you need to talk to me now because I'm hot. Get it? Yeah. Who's the hot one here? Me. Yeah. You. Yeah. Text me. Thank you. Yeah. And she's like, oh my god, it's like the most, it was like the most boring thing in the world to try to talk to this dude. And I'm That's like, well, yeah. Cool. Jonas, we should get hot. Uh, I'm working on it. We'll head in here on the next episode, though. All right, cool. All right, that's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoy our content. If you've already done that, just share it with every person in the entire world, even people you don't know, because we want that. And for Jonas. <laughs> what? <laughs> and for Jonas. You good, are you, you good, man? Dying, bro. And TNT Dynamite. Yeah, we're out.